I would like to inform all those gathered here that we are very honored to have amongst us uh, Mr. JVR Prasad Rao. He is um, the head of jury of the India Health and Wellness uh, Awards and he is a former Union Health Secretary who is with us today and I would request uh, Mr. Kamal Narayan to welcome him with a bouquet of flowers. <clears throat> Thank you so much, sir, for gracing uh, India Health and Wellness Awards. Uh, would request uh, Mr. JVR Prasad Rao to please come on stage and give us a short speech. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Um, frankly, I'm not prepared for a speech. I, I was asked to give an award, but now that I've been asked to, uh, just I want to say that uh, I'm so happy to be here. Um, I was hearing about these awards for the last two, three years. They have become quite uh, well known in the uh, health circles here. Uh, for the first time when the organizers, Mr. Narayan, asked me uh, to be uh, a member of the jury, yeah, I was uh, very happy to be uh, and accepted it. And, um, and today also, coincidentally, I'm here because uh, I live in Bangalore. I don't live in Delhi, like many of you. So I traveled uh, for a conference and I stayed on. Uh, and it's great to, to be with you. And, um, and it's good to see that health is getting this prominence because uh, traditionally, health has always been relegated to a low level of priority uh, in the national thinking in our country, it's not just government, even in the private sector. But slowly we are getting there. Uh, public health today has got a lot of prominence compared to what it was 10 years back. And um, I also uh, am in the board of uh, an organization called Public Health Foundation of India, which was founded when I was health secretary and it has seen many ups and downs. But uh, the good thing is it has been able to generate interest in public health in this country. So I am very happy about that. And today we have a number of public health schools producing excellent um, graduates and public health education research has got prominence so i think we are we are we are definitely making progress but as it was i was just listening to the discussion unless you look at those bottom rung of those 500 million people um, and improve their health status i think as a nation i don't think we'll be able to make any progress so when we talk about those 100000 wellness centers and all that it is essential that you raise the health status of those people it is not enough if we just think about a few hospitals in the urban areas and some uh, tertiary care units, etc. You need to promote public health right from the primary health level. I think that that is the main message uh, that all of us need to take back. And I wish at some point of time we need to recognize the contribution of individuals and organizations to promote public health at the primary level and also bring them to the award stage. So they, they can come to this stage and take an award for running a primary health center in some remote area extremely well and to see that you know, the primary health care needs of the people are taken into consideration. So those are the few things I want to say and I wish all of you well and I'm, I'm, I, I think many of you will be getting the awards so I look forward to that. Thank you. <clears throat> 